Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a fantabulous day. Let's get to the motherfucking point, okay? We're here to talk about Chantel and her losing fucking subscribers. I'm not talking about feeders. Uh-uh. Again, y'all know I can't talk about nobody being overweight because my ass is damn overweight. Y'all see these titties right here? They right here in your fucking face, okay? I can't talk about nobody being overweight. I got arm flap. I'm working on my shit though. And I'm not doing it the way Chantel is doing it. I'm taking my big ass to the gym. I'm running on the fucking treadmill. I'm lifting fucking weights. I'm lowering that calorie content. I'm lowering that carb content. And I'm losing fucking, fucking motherfucking weight. Okay? It might take me. So it's taking me three months to lose 30 pounds. So it's going to take me another fucking four months to lose the next 40 pounds. And then my ass is done. I'm not trying to be super skinny. I will show you guys when I was like so, 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 so skinny. I was about 108 pounds. I never in my life been that fucking skinny. In high school, I was about one, I was about 150. Y'all, I was fucking cute. And that is where I'm trying to get to, okay? I'm trying to get to my high school weight. Not that 150 because it was like, ooh, I was, I was definitely skinny, like skinny fat. But I, I, I'd be happy with like... I'd be happy with like 170 because then I got mommy curves. You know, I got shit that ain't going to go nowhere. I got a, probably the, the front little pouch there because I had a C-section. Some shit just ain't going to go nowhere. And I'm not going to kill myself to get there. I'm going to get myself there happily, okay? Let's get to the book at point. Chantel has manipulated the fuck out of her viewers. That bitch is fucking crazy. I mean, Amber's fucking crazy when it comes to being a narcissistic bullshit crazy girl with relationships and feeders but Chantel that bitch is fucking nuts y'all this woman has manipulated people so badly and they are so fucking done with her bullshit that they have openly said peace out I'm fucking done with your ass holy shit the only people that are fucking staying on Chantel's side are those fucking feeders. And she's got a lot of other fucking feeders. Y'all can see her subscriber, subscriber content. She's got a lot of fucking feeders. The people that join her chat, they're like feeders, but they're like trolling feeders. They're those kind of people. They're not your fucking friend. They want to see you get worse. That's not fucking friendly, okay? That's not your fucking friend, Chantel. God damn it, she's so fucking dumb. Like, I cannot... I'm just like, I, I, I agree with Charlie fucking Gold. This fucking girl is so fucking dumb. They're not your fucking friends, you dumb bitch. They're getting you more and more sick. Oh, yeah. Keep going to see Dom. Oh, yeah. Keep going to Montreal. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm an overweight girl. So I can't talk about her being overweight. But goddamn, she's making the most horrific, dangerous motherfucking decisions I have seen in a long ass time. It is angering me. And I come on here angry at Chantel and, and, and Amber every fucking day because they're so blatantly dumb, it's not even fucking funny. And Amber is gonna, she's gonna troll the fuck out of us as soon as Becky fucking leaves. She's gonna troll the fuck. And I hope to, and I pray to motherfucking God that Becky gets a YouTube channel. Because you know what? Y'all ain't seen that shit. Becky's spilling the fucking tea. She's just spilling that fucking shit. Spill it, Becky. We here for you, baby girl. We here for you. But Footy Beauty, that bitch is fucking crazy. We already know she's a stalker. She has an addictive personality. Next, that girl is going to do something real bad. I don't know what it is. She's going she's gonna to do something real fucking bad. I am scared for the person who ends up in a relationship with her because that bitch is crazier than a motherfucker. There's something, there's something evil inside of that girl. Y'all know they got that picture of Beyonce, that video of Beyonce rolling around right now where she's like um, uh, doing a song in her head she's, and she's turning into Sasha Fierce and they say she's turning into a demon. That is what's happening to Chantel. It is scary as fuck. I pray to the gods above that this bitch get herself together. This man is looking at me like, what the fuck are you talking to, bitch? <laughs> this girl get herself together. Because if not, she's on a dangerous fucking path. It's not fucking good. And ain't got shit to do with her weight. It's the shit she's doing to lose this goddamn weight. She's meeting the wrong men. She wants this fucking attention. That, 
is it narcissism? I don't know. It's like she lacks any type of self-esteem at all. That we know Amber got a bunch of self-esteem. She think her shit don't stink. Where Chantel, she think her shit is just bomb diggity damn. I mean, shit. This bitch has lost her motherfucking mind. And y'all see this roll right here? Y'all see that motherfucking roll? I'm earning that motherfucking roll. You know why? I'm getting my ass up and I'm going to the gym every fucking lunch day, okay? Monday through Friday, I take my ass to the fucking gym, okay? I do got a sports bar right now. Because, look, you got the, you can see the little pudge. Fucking now, I'm trying to hide that shit. I got a real fucking body. I had a baby. I got married. I had some shit going on. I'm losing that fucking weight. Okay? Woo! I had to get that out of me. Lord, I'm sick of her. I'm just going to watch uh, my girl Frenchie and Alex is shook. Because I can't do this shit. I can't watch her fucking shit. It's just too damn long. I got a fucking life. Woo -wee. Anyway, I'm going to get out of here. I hope you guys are having a great day. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.